Colon cancer is the number two cause of cancer death in our countries. In the United States, 150,000 people are diagnosed per year. It's highly preventable and it's shifting towards younger people. There has been a change in the last few years in terms of colon cancer where, you know, as an example, a person of uh, your generation, you and I are pretty close, I think, but I'm a little bit older. A person of your generation, four times more likely to be diagnosed with rectal cancer during their lifetime than my parents were. And twice, twice times more likely to be diagnosed with colon cancer compared to my parents' generation. And at the same time, what protects us? And I think you know where I'm gonna, what I'm gonna say, it's the fiber and the short chain fatty acids. And in that study that I was mentioning earlier from Andrew Reynolds, the professor from New Zealand, actually there, there was a powerful association between fiber consumption and protecting ourselves from colorectal cancer. So powerful that for every gram, five grams of fiber that we increase in our diet, we are getting a significant reduction in our risk. So it's not just, do you eat fiber or not? It's actually how much fiber do you eat and the more, the better.